माई फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक टू माई टू हंड्रेड थ्री डी कैड प्रॉब्लम्स इन फ्री कैड सीरीज टूडे आई वॉन्ट टू टॉक अबाउट एक्सरसाइज फाइव एक्सरसाइज फाइव इज ए फेयरली इजी ऑब्जेक्ट आई विल स्टार्ट फ्रॉम द टॉप एंड देन वर्क ऑन दिस टू साइड सो आई एम गेसिंग इट विल बी ए टू स्केच जॉब विद मिरर प्रोसीड्योर एट द एंड ऑफ द जॉब सो लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड विद एक्सरसाइज फाइव I have already loaded the technical drawing in FreeCAD. Uh, let's start processing the image. I want to keep one of these centers as my center of the sketch. there i will take that as okay and my first thing is to build a sketch on xy plane let me get started with a slot and then maybe another slot and i want to delete this part bring it up to here and connect them so the drawing part is done i want to make this two equal so that's that is one constraint i want to place a radius constraint on this as 20 this radius is given as 10 this length is given as 40 and so the inner slot is constrained the total length is given as 130 so that's a fully constrained sketch pretty simple i want to rename that as sketch base and uh, that sketch will be extruded for 10 so default 10 so there that's my base The second sketch is one of these walls. I want don't want to sketch both of those. I want to do one and then copy that over to the other side. So I want to do that on this face. So that would be X Z face. And so let me go ahead and then transfer this image to X Z face, right? And I want to transform it to the lower image where it makes more sense there maybe a bit too much so yeah i'll take that all right for this image i want to sketch on xz plane okay so the center of that sketch is here as it was in the previous location i want to draw it from this location so the length between these two we can we can measure to do that let me actually pull this line in or maybe this one yeah i want to pull this line in and i cannot see that line but i can see two points were uh, are visible so that line is actually at the middle where this the origin ac is there so to make it more visible or easy to work with i want to turn on the section view that helps there now i want to draw a circle and then maybe another slot okay yeah let's keep it here for now and i'm going to go ahead and delete this i want to make this diameter 50 so diameter 50 okay and this is diameter 30 right now this length the distance between this point and this line or rather this point is 
65 plus 40 so 65 plus 40 right that's one constraint what else I can place this line on this point or actually I want to make a line between these two make that horizontal I want to place this line on this line and make these two points same so one more degrees of freedom which is the height of this center which is 30 there so that's our sketch however that sketch is in the middle of the object but we want to place it on not at the middle at least so I want to place that sketch on this point and push it back or maybe this point and push it forward either way we'll have to adjust the location of that sketch so I want to rename that sketch as sketch side wall side wall that's like over constrained side or wall would do but hey let's keep it that way I want to move it on y direction so this is z this is x y direction i want to move it say i want to say 10 that's pushing back i want to bring it to my it's me so minus 10 now if it was at the center which is 20 space and then if i can bring it back by 10 that will still do so now it is at 10 and i want to extrude it for 10 okay right that worked now what I want to do is now this is our center this image is on the center line on that axis on X Z axis I want to mirror this part based on that X Z plane where the image is at now so that way I think that we got our object so one two three three parter so that is one two three I want to make all of those three as a union and a finishing touch maybe defining and there you go we got our object Yeah, that's it. That's the object. That is our object. Hope you enjoyed this process. I will see you in the next video.